welcome to the World Summit on the Information Society 2016 in Geneva, Switzerland. And I'm joined by Leon Strauss, President of the International Federation of Information Processing. So it's the ICT's professionals. Can you tell me why are you coming to the WISIS Forum? As the Federation of Information Professionals, um, it is something we uh, feel very important for us. We acquire a lot of knowledge on ICT, both in development, in research and in applications. And all this knowledge should be shared definitely with those countries that are lagging behind and are, do not have the resources or, and, and capabilities to, to uh, benefit from, from the advances in ICT. And how exactly do you go about sharing all of this knowledge? The most uh, common thing to do is uh, organizing conferences where we invite people from all disciplines, researchers, politicians, practitioners, to share the needs and to share the experiences on both sides. And that's very effective in the, in the last 10 years. We've been doing that since the Millennium Development Goals, since the WISIS started actually. Because I can imagine that what works in the West won't necessarily work in some of the developing countries. Exactly, not one-to-one. -one. I mean, the technology and, and the application is obviously similar, but the constraints are different, the local circumstances are different, so we need um, the involvement of both parties, of both sides, to, to discuss what is possible and what is needed. What are the constraints? What are these sort of constraints, for example? Uh, maybe the, the uh, infrastructure is not yet ready. Uh, maybe the level of education is not at, at the level it should be to advance, to, um, to benefit to the maximum. So there's quite a few uh, different perspectives to, to look at. So in fact, there's a lot of building capacity or training of people in these applications. Exactly. And I understand <coughs> that you are going to be speaking at a high-level session tomorrow. What's your main message there? My main message is partnership. I mean, we have a big community of, of professionals, but even that is a sort of a volunteer-based effort um, with a lot of volunteers wanting to do something. But it's, it's, a, it's a partnership that's required because we need the local, local community, the educators, the governments, etc. So, Tomorrow I will, I will make an appeal to look at partnerships, which is in the SDG number 17, to see how we can make progress. I mean, we've been talking about this for many years. So now let's see how we can come back next year and say we've managed to do a lot of partnerships. And what will you be looking at? Because what have you learned, as you say, that uh, this has been talked about for a number of years? So what have you learned about what makes a really good and solid partnership? I think one of, one of the pitfalls is to start too ambitious. I think starting on a, on a smaller scale, making sure you have a concrete proposal where you can show results, that's, that's beneficial and then the rest will follow. And you certainly can't copy and paste, it's something that Precisely. has to be worked out. Precisely. Well, I wish you luck in getting the partnerships that you need at this WISIS forum. Thank you very much for joining us, Leon Strauss, who's the president of the International Federation on Information Processing. And please do stay tuned to the ITU YouTube channel, where you can see many of the videos that we'll be doing during the forum.